All right, you two, we're here for round four of the challenge. We beat uh, Miracles last round. Round five, excuse me. We beat Miracles in round four. So we don't really know what our opponent's on yet, but we won the die roll, which is nice. Oh, come on. Oh, they kept, they revealed Annex. Okay. All right. I probably should have played out a basic land. Playing the old reanimator deck. Okay. I don't think this matchup is very good. Cobalt therapy. Okay. We can't brainstorm and then re brainstorm because our our we like we can't brainstorm into another brainstorm then draw a force again. The only thing that we can do here is just brainstorm after they reanimate this and hope we hit. All right, Chancellor, they won, yes, Force of Will, where are you? And scoop that. I'm not playing through a, uh, through a Gristle Brand. Yeah, I've been having a pretty good day. We're three and one. We're down a game though. So I want this, 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 this. Now, him to Torok is probably not that good. <clears throat> Coligon's command is probably not that good either. And I could just bring in a Diabolic Edict. I guess my fatal pushes are pretty bad. There's a lot of stuff that's pretty bad about this matchup. But I really don't want to him my opponent and put stuff, random stuff in their graveyard. I could just bring in two last hopes over these pushes because they're just ways to win the game. Like, I'll eventually just make enough zombies to win. Thank you for the birthday wish. Yeah, I'm going to do that. It's pretty medium, but... It's what we're going to do. All right, it seems pretty good. Chancellor of the Annex. This is going to take my force of will. Okay. So I'm going to break this Chancellor with my Snapcaster Mage at the end of my opponent's turn so that I can untap and just cast my Baleful Strix. Wow, they don't. 
It's kind of a way to put it in the graveyard. Okay. All right, we're gonna ponder for a land. We did hit a land. We had another land next turn to play Jace. But is that actually an avenue to victory? It's like the best I got, right? I kind of just hope that they, I think I have to hope they, they whiff because like, I don't know. Yeah, now I think I'm just going to jam this Jace. And just try to brainstorm into a free spell that will get me out of this. All right. All right, get in for one. Look at that. Look at that. You got the sword back, Lawrence. All right, so my opponent's going to discard a fatty. And we're going to start answering the call next turn. So what's the card underneath here is a Snapcaster. I don't really think I want that Snapcaster, but I don't want to just get Brainstorm locked. Let's find a Graph Digger's Cage or a Surgical Extraction. Show me a Graph Digger's Cage, Extraction, Nile Spellbomb, Tilt. I'll probably just put back both of these lands. And then I'm going to Snap Ponder. Yeah. I guess it doesn't matter. I'm going to go off of this. There's no real relevant black spells that I could hit. Or red spells, excuse me. All right, the Fluster Storm will play. Draw Angler next turn, turn up the heat. So I need three, they need two things. So we have one Spellsman cast. Can't fluster storm that one. Brainstorm. All right, put this back. Well, hang on. One, two, three, four, five, six. Put one in the graveyard. If I put one in the graveyard. And I've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Seven plus seven is 14. I can double Gurmag. Double, it's not like double Gurmag is a one turn clock, though. If it was a one turn clock, I would like it would mean more, but it's not. Yeah, I'd be much more inclined if they were dead next turn. Okay. 
Okay. Dang. Oh, wow. I can. No, I can't drop both of these. The nice thing here is that surgical also um, speeds up the clock. Oh no, it doesn't speed. It, it increases my fluster storm. I could also next turn like bounce my snapcaster with Jace. So they can entomb in response, but I can fluster storm it. Okay. So, Lawrence, I don't know exactly how to sideboard, but I pretty much thought him to Torak was not good and Kologon's command was not good. But I didn't have enough cards to bring in, so I brought in my last hope because it was a card that could win the game. Like, I cut this, this, and this. But it's like, is Kolagon's command better? I mean, I could shock my opponent. I just thought, like... So then it sounds like if him can be nuts, that I should have it in my deck over Liliana, because Liliana's always going to suck. Just as a way to kill something. I mean, it's probably better than this. I mean, this last hope just is supposed to sit here behind a wall and it just wins me the game. Hmm. All right. Submit. Really surprised we won that game. We just marched up to Jays. I mean, my opponent didn't have a way to put a creature into their graveyard. So they had to go, like, Natty discard. I mean, you just got to, like, got to keep this and shrug. No Chancellor. Not really much to talk about when it comes to this matchup, like Chromox. Huh. I didn't know they played Chromox. I mean, it makes sense. Okay. Oh. So my opponent's last card is Dark Ritual. Whew. Play this land in case I have to brainstorm, I can save a fetch. I might end a turn brainstorm, to be honest. I think I'm going to end a turn brainstorm, because I would like to be able to cast a Baleful Strix if I can get one. Or, like, ponder and to do something else. Jeez. And I have Snapcaster, too. Yeah, I just thought about, like, because I, I have two impactful spells that are, um... Yeah, those were two good hits. Well, I also have, like, I, I, I tell you, I made a mistake. I didn't think about it because I haven't played 
Like I put a Graph Diggers cage in my sideboard, which is like awful with Snapcaster Mage. So like I was like, oh, I could go like hit a Ponder, and then I can go Ponder into Cage or Spell Bomb. All right, I'm gonna fetch in my upkeep. Okay. All right, well, there's our way to win. Now, do I just start immediately going up with this or am I brainstorming? Okay. Oh, you're just talking about to get some get on the battlefield. Okay, so it's just this one. They have a Magus. They have two Maguses. Three Gristle Brands. You let them just take the... Oh, because I have Edict and Jace. You're right. You're right. That was stupid. No, you're right. That was just dumb. I, I didn't think about it like that. Yep, yeah, no, you're right. Yep, you you you're hundred percent right. Now, is it okay? I probably should now snap surgical the Chancellor. Because then it covers the next draw step, and then I can untap with Jace. Because then I have the next draw set covered. Yeah. Yeah, that was loose. That was loose on my part. And brainstorm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. See, we're all we're all still learning. No, there's no reason for me to do this. Hang on. There's no reason for me to pay life. I'm always, I've like, I think I've paid life with surgical like 98% of the time I cast it. I don't know if this. I mean, they can, sometimes, like, it's just the Black Red Reanimator where they just have it, right? Yeah. Another Snapcaster is nice. Oh, that's funny. <clears throat> oh, hide this now. Okay, okay, you're right. You're right. I just kind of checked out of it. I was like, oh, we're good. No, you're right, Lawrence. I didn't play that match very well. I mean, like we won, but I, I didn't play. I didn't play this match very well. So, 